how I looked at the first time he cut, like when he was smiling in my face. I don't like when people smile. Like when people be smiling, I feel like you're taking me out of a joke. You know what I'm saying? I'm from New York, bro. Like if a nigga smile in my face in New York, like I'm from, I'm we from, we from, we from New York. I'm from Brooklyn. I'm from, the, I'm from the hood. So if I'm, if I'm, if I'm talking to him and he start laughing in my face, I'm a, that's disrespectful. So you felt like you had to throw the first punch there. Of course. If I'm looking at, if I'm looking at Duke and he and he looking at me, he starts smiling in my face in New York. I probably would have smacked him. And, and, you, and he predicted eighth round knockout. What are you predicting? Six round. What did his breath uh, smell like up there? He went pretty close, but what does breath smell like? Like shit. <laughs> like fucking donkey, donkey balls. What, Edgar, what, what about Edgar, you mentioned him, like, did you have to start? Why did you feel like you had to start kind of talking shit to him, kind of getting under his skin? What, what was it about like the energy that you felt it was off for me to say something? Nah, because he just got a guia. I kept saying guia in Spanish. That's like a, a cocky dude. He's cocky. That's why Mexicans don't like him. That's why. That's why he wanted because he think you know he. He a diva. He a diva. He a diva. He, he's the type of dude that if if a side of his shirt is not iron, he's gonna be wild. Oh my god! Oh my shirt is not you. He's like that. I don't like dudes like this. He's a little faggot. Edgar, 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 you Puerto mentioned Rico. you mentioned Charlo, and and a lot of people thought he gave too much respect. Just uh, is that is that a lot of what was going on up there? You just don't want to show him too much respect, and how important is that? Yeah, that's fight? it. The fighter signed, bro. September fourteenth. That's it. I then I said it back there. At the end of the day, September 4th, he didn't have to say he was going to take my hair. Oh, I'm not going to have no compromises with you. I guess that's what he does when he did with Tomogia. He probably held back on Tomogia, son. But with me, I already know I'm Puerto Rican, bro. And a lot of a lot of people don't like me, so I already know he's going to go in there with bad blood. So I already, I already felt his aura. I felt everything inside him. I son of a gun my house over him. You, you, you talked about, you talked yeah, about uh, your IQ being the key to this fight. Of course, but will you IQ, press him? Will you yeah, impose your power? Of course, of course. You're going to see something, bro. September 14th, bro. And a guy like him is going to really take the best out of me. You feel me? Like, and that's the type of person I am. Like, I don't know. Like, when I was young and I used to play basketball, when I used to play basketball with, with a kid, like, I probably know I could be. I'm like, I'll be fucking around. But then when I used to go and they used to put the them boys in, on, on the court, I used to step up. I used to go crazy, same thing in boxing. I used to do the same thing. And now this is the fight of my life, you know what I'm saying? This is right here in history, you know? I don't take this shit like, a, like how all these other guys taking it, you know what I'm saying? This is some for my island, this is something for, for my son, for my last name, Belanga. Look at that last name, bro. That's legendary, man. Like Canelo Belanga, Canelo, that's legendary for me. How do you impose your power and go forward? You, you, you said he stays up there too. He's a great counterpuncher. So how do you do that? Sacar la mierda. You give him the taste of his own medicine. You want to punch him? We've been practicing for 20 years. 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 Canelo's best win. Probably Triple G. It's probably Triple G because I feel like when he beat Triple G, he beat Triple G at his, at his peak. You know what I'm saying? Edgar, ¿qué fue lo que más te prendió ahorita que te hizo enojar o molestar? Con, con Canelo. Sí. 